This session is brought to you by Bill King of Medcom Diabetics. Be sure to share this valuable information with your family and friends. There are three main types of diabetes. Type 1 diabetes. This results from the immune system mistakenly attacking and destroying the insulin-producing beta cells in the pancreas. People with type 1 diabetes require lifelong insulin therapy to survive. It often develops in childhood or adolescence, but can occur at any age. 2. Type 2 Diabetes This is the most common form of diabetes, accounting for the majority of cases worldwide. It typically develops in adulthood, although it is increasingly being diagnosed in children and adolescents due to rising obesity rates. Type 2 diabetes is characterized by insulin resistance, where the body cells fail to respond effectively to insulin, leading to elevated blood sugar levels. It may be managed through lifestyle modifications, oral medications, insulin therapy, or a combination of these approaches. 3. Gestational diabetes. This type occurs during pregnancy and is characterized by elevated blood sugar levels that develop or are first recognized during pregnancy. While it usually resolves after childbirth, women with gestational diabetes have an increased risk of developing type 2 diabetes later in life, as do their children. Common symptoms of diabetes include increased thirst, frequent urination, extreme hunger, unexplained weight loss, fatigue, blurred vision, slow healing of wounds, and recurrent infections, but some people may have diabetes without experiencing any noticeable symptoms, especially in the early stages. Several risk factors contribute to the development of diabetes, including genetics, family history, obesity or being overweight, sedentary lifestyle, poor diet, high in processed foods, and sugar. Advancing age, ethnicity certain populations, such as African Americans, Hispanics, Native Americans, and Asian Americans, are at higher risk. History of gestational diabetes, polycystic ovary syndrome POCOS, and metabolic syndrome. Diabetes prevalence has been steadily increasing worldwide, driven primarily by the rise in type 2 diabetes due to factors such as sedentary lifestyles, unhealthy dietary habits, and increasing rates of obesity. According to the International Diabetes Federation IDF, approximately 463 million adults aged 20, 79 years were living with diabetes globally in the year 2019, with this number expected to rise to 700 million by 2045 if current trends persist. Understanding the basics of diabetes, including its types, symptoms, risk factors, and prevalence, is essential for early detection, effective management, and prevention of complications. Public awareness and educational initiatives play a crucial role in promoting healthy lifestyle behaviors and reducing the burden of diabetes on individuals, families, and healthcare systems worldwide.